I've been a bad vlogger the last couple days. I have not filmed anything. The only time I pulled my camera out of my pocket, which is my phone, people always say, what kind of camera do you use? It's my phone. <laughs> I just took a picture of my breakfast today at the Flying Pig. Um, it's one of those places I've always wanted to go to, but they're, they're only open Monday through Friday until like 2. So, we finally got to try breakfast, and I'm getting ready to eat the last half of my omelet. And then I got a bowl of, I got a couple little cukes, like three radishes, a couple little carrots, and some cherries. Got me a bowl of produce. Yeah. Uh, yesterday when I got up was Sunday. Dad said, let's go for a ride and get a sandwich or something, because we hadn't been out because it was hot. And so we took a ride. We used a coupon out of a coupon book, and I wanted. To, I've always heard this bar called Chatterbox always has really good burgers, and they do. We tried the Chatterbox my first time. Dad had been there before, but my first time, and uh, I just got a cheeseburger deluxe. It was very good. And uh, we took a ride by the lake, and I came home and did some work. Then. This morning, got up, showered, out of the house by 8.30. Well, I think it was about 8.30. Had to go up to the shop, to the other office, and talk to Paige, one of our employees, about EOM stuff, which is end-of-month billing, which is a lot of our farmers. And then I was talking to Michelle about a few work orders. And then Ronnie was floating in and out. So we were there for a couple hours, maybe. And, uh... Dad was sitting in the one chair in the office by at a table and Kitty was just laying on his lap. She she likes to lay on people's laps. She's Michelle's buddy usually. She sits up on Michelle's desk or sits on her lap while Michelle does work. You know, the guys were going everywhere and toilets are going everywhere and uh So after we left the office we went and got, had our breakfast, then came home and sat at my desk, and I just got done working there at about 5.30. But I got all the EOMs billed, except for one I'm waiting to hear about tomorrow. I have payroll done, because I had to run it early because of the holiday this week. Uh, I printed out about 100 invoices for from this new business we bought. But I have Ronnie's supposed to put make a little letter because all these new invoices we're putting a letter in saying hi this is who we are prices are going to go up uh, we're trying to compile as many e email addresses as possible so uh, I need to get some stamps because I'm I have a few left in a roll and I'm, it's going to take me a whole roll just to mail out <laughs> all of that. Uh, but I got them all printed out. It's like a stack like this. And uh, I need to type them all out into my billing sheet. That batch, batch number 12. Uh, it's going to be a huge batch of billing every every time it rolls around. Um, there's different ways of billing different things. All of our stuff that goes out, like monthly rentals, we, we bill on a 28-day cycle. So when someone, on a construction worker, calls and says, I need one delivered... Here it's going to be out there for a long time. They go in what they, we call batch billing. So every 28 days it gets billed and it has its own batch number. And then there's EOMs and a month billing, which is farmers usually. Yeah, it's pretty much farmers. Um, you have one campground, a horse club, uh, the people who rent a big trailer at the winery. Um, but mainly farmers. And then we have event billing. Like if an event happens, it just gets billed and sent out. whole lot of 4th of July stuff getting billed here this week. And then, like I said, they're trying to get stuff shuffled out the Redbud Track and Trail, which is the Nationals of Motocross. It'll be on TV at some point. So if you run across Redbud Trail, National Motocross this weekend, it's here by me. Uh, there's another big event going to be out there in October that is supposedly supposed to be like the Olympics of motocross. It's even bigger than this Nationals thing. 
the one in October is supposed to be writers from all over the world. So that's going to be interesting. I wonder how many of our toilets are going to get blown up this year. Every year, somebody puts an M80 in a toilet. It's inevitable. Last year we lost two, and the other toilet company, I think, lost two. So we're going to see how it goes. That is the one thing I'm very happy that Heidi cannot hear anymore because thunderstorms and fireworks used to put her in a panic. Now, nothing. She used to also hate the garbage truck when he'd roll around every Thursday morning. Boy, she'd hear him and she would try to kill him through the front window. Not sleeping. She's sitting on the back of the couch. Heidi ho! She can't hear me. I still talk to her. I know she can't hear me. Uh, she, there's a certain pitch of a whistle that will get her attention. She'll look at me. She knows I, I want her attention. So that is good. Anybody got any big plans for the 4th of July? Fall on smack dab in the middle of the week is kind of me, But, you know, it happens. It happens. My friend Nikki, her, her daughter Al, who went with me to go see Lizzie, her and her dad are at uh, Cedar Point in Ohio today. They might be out of the park by now. I don't know I don't know how late they were staying. They were going to spend the whole day there. They went last night spent the night. We're going to spend the day in the park and then come home. So I bet you they had a good time. A really good time. Dad's gone to the Legion. There is a serviceman who just came back from Iraq, Afghanistan. He's a son? Or is he a grandson of one of the members? And they're just having a, all the guys are welcoming him, welcoming him back. So, they went to go do that. But now, I'm going to eat my omelet while it's still warm. It's in this black box. Let's check it out, shall we? I put ketchup on it and watch something on the DVR. I don't even know what I have recorded. There isn't a whole lot recording right now because there isn't much new stuff. New stuff, Big Brother, Think of America's Got Talent. I think that's about all it's recording right now. Yeah. Okay. We'll see. What tomorrow is going to be a day of. Hopefully getting that letter to put with these invoices. And, uh, because I can't do anything with those invoices until I get a letter put with them. We'll just see what happens. Alright. I'll see you all later. Bye.